I don't know about you, but I am addicted to these cleaning and organizing TikToks that are all over my For You page. I just can't get enough of them. They are so satisfying. I never thought the day would come where I would say this, but I am so excited to clean my bathroom. And it is very likely that after watching this video, you're gonna wanna clean your bathroom as well. So let's begin. This is me. If you didn't already know, I recently moved out to LA by myself and I have no idea what I'm doing, but I'm gonna pretend like I do. I'm a complete noob when it comes to adulting, which you can probably tell if you've been keeping up with my moving series. And in this video, it is going to be me versus my bathroom. We had to go out and buy a bunch of cleaning and organizing supplies. I went to Walmart, Amazon, and Target. I'm quickly gonna show you an overview of everything that I got, but I'm not gonna go into depth about each item. I'll be explaining everything that I got and what I'm gonna be using each item for throughout the video. So first, from Amazon, we got a bunch of organizing stuff. I got jars, containers, shelves. Not only am I gonna be showing how you I'm organizing my bathroom, but I'm also gonna have a segment in this video where I organize my little laundry room. Next, I got a bunch of basic cleaning supplies. Here's an overview of all of the cleaning supplies that, that I got. These are all just the basic essentials. Then lastly, from Target, I got more organizing supplies. Okay, so first, let's begin by cleaning the surfaces in the bathroom. As soon as I finished wiping down all the surfaces, it was time to put on some gloves because it was about to get intense. And can we also take a moment to appreciate how cute my pink gloves are? Anyways, it was time to deep clean my sink. Okay, so next we're gonna be tackling the cabinet. I had to go out and buy a few of these to basically help me organize everything that is in there. Um, I kind of just have everything shoved in here. I don't even know how this is gonna work. Honestly, I'm just gonna wing it. And if it works, it works. And if it doesn't, then it doesn't. from Lush was this hand soap. This is called the Sea Vegetable Soap. It's a little block of hand soap. I love their hand soap so much. I'm gonna be putting this into the little soap dish that I bought from Target and then just leaving this by my sink. And I got this face mask and it smells just like roses. And then lastly, I just got this sleepy shower gel. Since my bathroom doesn't have those little pull-out drawer thingies, I decided to buy this Alex drawer, which I put right outside my bathroom to help me organize my makeup. I have been keeping my makeup for the longest time now in this huge bag. It's like all scrambled up in there, which has been so annoying. I bought a bunch of these organizing trays that I used to see all the time all over my TikTok and Pinterest. It was always so satisfying watching people organize their makeup and skincare in these things. So prepare yourself for the intense ASMR moment that we are about to have.
Shower. So as you can see behind it me, doesn't really seem to be dirty or messy But if you look closely the shower glass has a bunch of water stains Which I need to get rid of and inside my shower products are literally just scattered everywhere So I'm finally gonna be organizing those with these little shower caddies that I bought recently I bought these that are supposed to stick onto the wall So I'm gonna be attempting to hang these up after I clean the shower Also, if any of you are questioning my little plant behind me, she's actually the newest addition to my bathroom I talked about my eucalyptus plant in my last video I went to a flea market recently and picked her up. I learned that having a eucalyptus plant on your shower head has actual benefits for you. Apparently, the oils from the plant's leaves can provide benefits of aromatherapy, which can be calming and stress relieving, and it's also supposed to help with nasal congestion. So before we do any organizing, we must clean the shower. Business. When I first moved in, I had bought this like pink cart thingy for my bathroom to help me organize all of my bathroom products And the idea of it was cute, but now that I've owned it for a while It began to get really messy looking. I started to feel like every time I was walking into my bathroom I would get anxiety. It was just really hard to keep organized when I had that many products sitting in it So I decided to get rid of it I actually found this cuter one at Target. It's so much more minimalistic looking and I'm not going to be keeping much in this I bought a few of these super cute jars that I'm going to be filling with my basic bathroom essentials I'm also super excited about this diffuser I got. I'm going to be keeping this in my bathroom And you guys can just see here how I'm going to be organizing this little cart Done. Pause. I did notice that 40% of you are actually not subscribed. Um, what the heck? Did you know subscribing is free and it only takes one second? If you subscribe right now, you will get 10 years of good luck. Anyways, next we have this wall here. Basically, what we're going to be doing is adding some little shelves right here that I actually ordered from Amazon. Since this mirror here doesn't actually open, I really wanted to have somewhere to actually store all of the skincare that I use every morning and every night. And I have seen these shelves. I thought these shelves were perfect. I basically want to put them here to have my skincare up on display. finished with the shelves, it was time to move on to cleaning the toilet. I basically just wiped the entire thing clean. I was hoping to have a satisfying toilet cleaning moment, just like all the TikToks I see with all the moms that dump a bunch of things into their toilet, but my toilet wasn't that dirty. I thought that was unnecessary, so this was all that I did. Okay, I just finished cleaning the toilet. Uh, very proud of myself. So I did get these like toilet cleaning stamps. The entire time I was cleaning my toilet, I was literally looking forward to using these. Like they're just little squishy jelly things that make your toilet smell good. 
Um, so when you stamp these, this is what they're supposed to look like. But I have no idea what I did wrong. Um, that is so ugly. What? I'm gonna go cry now. BRB. I am over it. I have been going at this, scrubbing nonstop for like the past two and a half hours. I am done. But not really. I still have a lot to do. I'm just gonna take a break. I'm gonna take a shower. And I will resume with all of the cleaning and organizing later tonight. <sighs> I just realized that my camera decided not to record the audio of this next part of the video that I filmed. So here we are going to voice over the rest of the video. Basically, I was explaining that I had felt like I lost all of my brain cells to all of the chemicals that I was dealing with yesterday. So I decided to pick up where I left off the next day. I only had a few things left to do. One which included organizing my laundry room. I had bought a bunch of things to help me organize my laundry room. I wanted to look super aesthetically pleasing looking because my goal in life is to be those moms with those super aesthetic cleaning routines and so of course we had to go out and buy a bunch of aesthetic cleaning supplies so here is me organizing everything for my laundry room last thing that I needed to do was just add the final finishing touches to the bathroom. I bought this little crystal diffuser thingy. I also got my hands on some new plant babies recently. If you have any cute plant baby names, let me know in the comments below, please. Anyways, it is now time for the finished bathroom tour. Thank you so much for supporting my channel and making this all possible. That is all. Love you guys so much and bye. bye.